Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel, TV Scoop Entertainment, where we bring the latest scoop in South Africa. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do make sure that you do so and that you hit the notification bell for more TV Scoop Entertainment videos. Today, I'm going to be doing a follow-up story on the Sandy Lindlovu story that I covered earlier on in this year. If you do remember, Sandy Lindlovu was a first-year student at the Devon University of Technology and unfortunately, that's where he met his untimely death. So I also mentioned that the students actually united, you know, to pray for Usandi Lentlovu and they were outside of the hospital. Um, there's a video that I need to show you guys when the students were actually praying for Sandy Lentlovu. Here it goes. So guys, today we just learned that the killer of Sandy Lindlove has actually been found. He's actually been uh, sentenced. So do you remember the family were not shown the CCTV footage where the killer was entering the premises. They only showed them the footage where Sandy Lindlove was entering the premises. So the killer has been found and his name is Msizi Mbuto. He's a 29 year old. So he has been convicted before for house robberies and that he was actually on parole, you know, when he committed this deed, the killing of Usandi Lenklofu. So guys, this thing, it was a very complicated case to think that the family were not shown the original CCTV footage where the killer was entering the premises and exiting. They were not given that, so that's what frustrated me. That's why I also covered this story. Because to me, it sounded like, uh, why would they not show the family the face of the person who did this thing? So I would guess that the family managed to resolve that behind closed doors, and they never showed that to the media. So henceforth, I was never aware of what was happening in this story. But at the end, justice was served. What I also learned about this 18-year-old Sandy Le was the fact that he was an only child and when the family found that he was brain dead, they were so devastated. And of course, there came a moment whereby they had to switch off the machines and that is the hardest, hardest task ever. So the killer of Sandy Lindlovu, Msizi Mbuto, has been sentenced to life in prison. Sandy Lindlovu, may your soul continue to rest in peace. And I pray that your family, your mom and your dad, may find peace in this. Unfortunately, you cannot be brought back to this life, but your memories, they live on. Guys, that was it for today. Do comment down in the comment section down below. What do you think about, you know, justice having to be finally served? And yeah, that's about it. So thank you for watching TV Scoop Entertainment. Comment and please do subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the notification bell. Until next time, goodbye.